so for today we're going to be looking at the year three armor set for the hunters if you guys don't know if this is your first video we usually review the armor which is right here we go over how it looks how it shaders my personal thoughts and then we have a shader video which is right here um i still don't know if this one only has my favorites or it's all the shaders but either way moving forward um once we get new armor which i don't know when we're going to get new armor but moving forward after we get new armor I will only be reviewing or showcasing my favorite shaders because I have a lot of shaders so much so that it takes me 18 minutes to do all three classes and I've legitimately fallen asleep sometimes. So that's why I'm doing that. And then to explain what we're doing in this video, we take individual pieces from the armor we reviewed and then make individual sets from those pieces. So for example, we're going to have a set that just uses the helmet for this one, which is the first one we're going to be looking at. So that's pretty much how I operate. If you if we get a new armor set, just expect me to make five armor sets from it. So let me know what you guys think. Make sure to hit the bell notification to keep up with my content, because if you guys don't know, I push out a lot of content, guys. I and it's only just me. So that's why it takes a while for me to produce some of my content, because I don't have any editors. I don't have anything like that. It's just me doing this. So I would appreciate a like a comment sub all of that because again i do think my content is worth it so let me know what you guys think i appreciate you guys let's just get into it so to start off we're going to be looking at this one i love the way lauren's iron mask it's one of my favorite helmets in the game definitely pick this up because it is such a good helmet for the exotic we're going to be using the thaliers reach ornament for the liars handshake i really like combining this one with the nemean strides just because it's like the opposite of each other like for example the left um arm has an armor armor piece to it but then when you go to the boots the green like cloth is there so it's like it's opposite which kind of like evens it out on both sides for me for the chest piece i'm kind of cheating because i'm using the jensen knight caress and for those of you who don't know or who are thinking like why are you, why would that be cheating the way lauren not way lauren the named lord's chess piece because they all have different names but it's called the, the named lord set the named lord set uses the jensen knight as a basis so that's why i'm saying that kind of cheating because it's technically two pieces but it's also not because the chess piece doesn't have the like lines or the engravings which is why i'm using the jensen knight instead for the cloak white wolf cloak is easily becoming one of my favorite cloaks especially for a night look this looks amazing the only negative i could say about this is i wish i really really wish we had the option to take the cloak off because that, i think that would be better because then this would truly be a night look for me but for the shader iron to steel is what we're using this is the shader that comes with the name lord set so if you are wondering what that shader is that's just by default on the name lord set it is iron to steel which should be dropping from iron banner so let me know what you guys think about this one this one's definitely my favorite but i have switched it up here and there as for the next set i'm gonna be honest with you guys this one is trash i hate it this one is definitely the l of the group that being said i don't think it's like any any piece pieces fault except for the arms and the boots I just think they're too specific, which is a big problem with fashion. If it's too specific, most of the time it's not going to look good. That being said, you might find some cool things with the arms or the boots. Definitely let me know in the comments below. But me personally, I just didn't really want to waste time with this because I wanted to use the other pieces. So for the helmet, wing contender with Jack Arena, so that way I can get a white. And then for everything else, bitter pearl because reasons. Also because the Valhunt ornament or yeah the Valhunt ornament for the six coyote I wanted to like at least have some color uh, combo with the fur on the chest piece with the fur for mantle of effort D for the boots and the arms we're using the name Lord sets which is the Galleon's iron grips and the Hakan uh, iron strides so not I really don't have much to say about this one the reason I think this is an L is because and I think I've mentioned this in the actual review of the video the chess piece for the name iron lord set has pieces on the hips that's attached to it i definitely think the hakan iron strides should have gotten those leather pieces because when you look at the hip it looks very very naked 
so like that's like my only negative about the uh this armor set that being like honestly if i'm being quite honest this armor is being carried heavily by the cloak and the helmet uh maybe the chest piece too but the arms and boots i think are fucking terrible as for the next set we're going to be using the as for the next set we're going to be using the chest piece for this one the perun's iron cuirass love this chest piece it's one of my favorite chest pieces the only negative again like i said is the fact that the for some reason they have something on the thigh that's like super like huge on leather and it's attached to the chest piece i think that should have just been attached to the boots because then the boots would have been better for it for the helmet sun apex mask is what we're using just because uh i want to have that color with the arms which is going to be the caliban's hand with no ornament just the basic look of it i really like this look the only negative i would say is just that it's not symmetrical for the boots strides of the great hunt and then solstice cloak rekindled unfortunately i think that one's just immediately you cannot have it anymore so i love this set with night's chill let me just say that night chill shader is really really cool unfortunately i think this one is unobtainable as well very unfortunate but i like where my head's going with this one if i'm being quite honest i would honestly just switch out the perun's iron caress for the jensen knight just because I want like I want to say that but I do think the Perun's iron caress like the leather straps at the or not straps but the leather piece on the thighs goes really well with this because it gives more color with the solstice cloak it kind of like has that matching color so as much as I would like that piece to be on the legs I'm also like not like oh Bungie you need to change it. it's like eh, I in this instance I like how it looks because it gives more purple in there which means that it, the cloak is not the only purple in this but overall i do think this looks amazing uh the reason i'm using night chill aside from it being an amazing shader is that the glow actually is orange which is why what you're seeing with the calvin's hand so that's why i'm using that and then last but not least we're going to be using the effort iron cloak i think i've utilized this for the white wolf set for the hunters if you guys haven't seen that video i'll have it up right now it's the witcher armor that we did and I think this one's amazing. Uh, the only thing, the only negative I could say about this is it's not truly symmetrical because the chest piece has some pieces that are not symmetrical, which the chest piece, I don't mind it. The boots, however, I kind of do mind, but at the same time, I don't. It's pretty interesting. Let's talk about it. So for the helmet, we're going to be using the Assassin's Cow with the Armory Exhibition Ornament. Cannot wait for this ornament to come out because I'm going to be utilizing it on a lot of things. The White Wolf Grips for the arms. Un unyielding favor vest for the chest piece iron companion boots and then effort iron cloak for these shaders we're going to be using the dawning brilliance except for iron companion boots because stalwart tenant gives a better color because unfortunately the iron companion boots for the pants takes off colors and it looks really really terrible and i do think stalwart tenant looks amazing with this so i don't hate the iron companion boots i think they're cool they're one of my favorite boots from destiny one the only negative is that it takes shaders really fucking terribly not only that it is asymmetrical but it's not enough to piss me off it's just more of a like i noticed it but i'm not really mad about it because the unyielding favor technically has well it's it's, it's asymmetrical as well because there's a strap in the middle that is not symmetrical but at the same time it's so little that it doesn't really phase me but i would be like i still have to remind you so let me know what you guys think i definitely think this one and the first one are like amazing and for sure the second one is the l of the group so much so that i i think that's the worst set i've ever made in the channel so let me know what you guys think i appreciate y'all again remember like comment sub because my channel is worth it especially if, if you want to keep up to the date with my current content hit the bell notification remember other than that i will see you guys later